Where did the high collars come from? The what? The high collars for shirts. I don't know, because I guess just from him, because stars like Brando and them that he idolized and Dean, they turn their collars up. So I always just thought, why not just make the collar bigger and then you don't have to turn it up. So that's why he did it. And he did that with his personal shirts. And then of course the jumpsuits, he had the real high, that was like that Edwardian type thing that they wore in Britain. You know, the way they wore those high collar uh, coats and, and, and everything. So that was part of it. And I think Liberace contributed to it quite a bit. When Elvis went out there to Vegas in 1956, uh, Liberace was there performing at the New Frontier, and he wild, he had wild outfits, and Elvis uh, was talking to him about them. Man, those, and Liberace says, well, I figure that if I can't, uh, something happens where I can't do my show, I can always put on a fashion show. And he meant it. I'll just parade out there and let them see my gorgeous outfits. <laughs> but I think Elvis realized then, flamboyancy is, you know, he was already dressing in the pinks and the blacks and, and then the lime green and stuff in the 50s. But getting on and doing the show, he realized that you need, there's an image up there and you better, you better make that image very attractive as, as much so as you can. So people remember you. And that's what he, they sure remember him.